Hello friends and once again welcome to BISPSolution.com Today onwards we start working on preparing a CFO dashboard So if you are a CFO of a company what information you like to see So there are a series of videos I'm going to show you live example how to extract data from financial system Maybe from Oracle EPS, PeopleSoft or Oracle Hyperion Financial management So in today video I'm going to show you how to prepare income statement analytics we are going to do the same analysis using tableau and oracle data analyzer and also try to evaluate the product which one has a better data visualization capabilities so we start with tableau as you see in my sample dashboard it consists of we have got income statement which in turn consists of net profit net sales and profit margin the first part of the video the first part of the slide a dashboard talk about year over year your net profit net sales and gross margin on the bottom side of your dashboard is talk about your cost of goods sold operating expenses and more detailed view right so let's start working on this the first step is to bring data from source system in this example i'm using oracle hyperion product called hyperion financial management and this is financial consolidation product so we input the trial balance data into this and data got loaded and consolidated once data got consolidated i'm going to extract data from the source so i use data extract option and whatever information I like to extract you define over here define the data source file and define all the intersection so as per my requirement over here i like to see quarter over quarter monthly quarterly net profit net sales and profit margin so before we extract it i like to show you the account hierarchy my account hierarchy something look like this way this is my account hierarchy where i have got net profit net income gross margin and different elements of gross margin and total cost in addition to this i've got a total asset total liabilities type of assets type of liabilities and so on so in a subsequent videos we are going to prepare more advanced financial reporting for now let's focus only on income statement so i click on extract data and extract data into my text file i define what data source i like to extract i like to extract actuals for Whichever year I like to extract, you define year. I'm going to extract for 2004, 2005, or multiple years. For which period, I can define the hierarchy quarterly, monthly, weekly. I mean, lowest level is monthly in this example. So I like to see monthly and quarterly expenses and revenue. For which entity? Entity is like your department, your organization structure can confine to a specific entity and account right so I'm going to extract data for net profit net income and gross margin because I like to see consolidated view I don't want to get into more detail view in this example so I look at parent level member click on this and extract I'm going to extract this data into my flight file once data got extracted you can look at your data this is your data which you want to extract right this is a raw structure structure semi-structure format so before we actually build a report on top of this we are going to do some kind of data massaging or normalization of your data so let's go to the next level data extraction is done next step is to build report on top of this so i'm going to open my tableau and load this sample data which is just now extracted all right, let's uh, extract the data. This is my data, which I just now extracted okay, from my source system. So I got net profit, net sales, and profit margin. Okay, you see my data structure. The data which you see over here does not have any header and it's a simple text file. So I, before I start using it, I need to do some kind of normalization and massaging with data. So go to your HFM, uh, sorry, Tableau. Click on your data source click on text file point your text file this is my text file right so by default your tableau bring all the data and you see the headers are missing therefore it has taken f1 f2 f3 and so on right 
the delimit of a semicolon tableau is smart enough it able to differentiate multiple column by using the semicolon as a delimiter but headers are not available therefore you need to define the header in addition to this you also need to specify column type because tableau by reading the text it can read the number text boolean but it cannot differentiate further so i'm going to give a custom defined heading over here select this right click and rename it the little time consuming i'm going to define it first one is scenario second one is going to be year and wherever you want to modify the type you can change it your year third one is your period and so on periodic is your view In the same fashion you're going to give name for all the members now important point over here right now i don't need all of them i need entity and i need financial elements which is my profits net profit net sales which is f13 i'm going to click over here and right click and rename i name it as financial element and i call this this is my uh my income statement right all right let's do the build a report on top of this so i have got a visualization the way i like to prepare it should supposed to consist of years 2010 11 12 net sales net profit and gross margin across different quarters i'm going to prepare in a similar fashion so you got a financial elements over here you got income statement income statement right and you got all the member the problem over here the data does not differentiate between income statement net profit not sales net sales and profit margin i need to differentiate this so first make system assume your year is your major convert to dimension right next step your financial elements are if you look at your financial element this is how it look like i got uh, financial elements across entity period scenario across different period right so your financial element consists of three members let me open this data file the financial elements are your only your numbers right you also like to add a header over here for net profit net sales i'm going to change this a little bit this is supposed to be the data i rename it as data and my financial element is f7 rename it and this is financial element but it never talk about no never talk about whether it is net profit net sales or gross margin this is what we need to prepare it so what i'm going to do now i'm going to differentiate these majors by net profit net sales okay so right click on this create a calculative fill name it as net sales and if an if condition if financial element equals to net sales then this would be treated as if and this is going to be net sales okay. similarly i create net sales and profit margin and net profit i'm going to create another element on top of this create calculate fill second one is going to be your net profit so name it net profit if my financial element is net profit then it's going to be net profit and finally i'm going to create one more member on top of this call profit margin profit margin if financial element equals to 
profit margin then display sales this is how i differentiate data into three pieces profit margin net profit and net sales right now we are ready to build a visualize this data as well for a given year i'm going to select year in my column i've got only one year of data so far 2004 and for different period period is going to be a month so it is a nesting year by period for different financial elements so my financial elements are net profit net sales and profit margin but i like to display them in terms of charts so we've got multiple options to display bar chart line chart stack chart okay i'm going to display this in terms of bar chart by using dual access okay so i'm going to use only net sales and remove two major and just swap it depends upon vertical or horizontal how do you want it i'm going to use the two majors for 2004 this is my net sales across different months in addition to net sales i also like to display net profit so drag and drop net profit add it in a dual access when you add in a dual access the default type turns out to be a, a automatic type it's like a shape i'm going to change this type to first one i like to display as bar chart the net sales and net profit i like to display as a line chart okay as a line chart so line is a discrete value therefore they are displaying the dot you could turn it type to line chart or you can display as a square oval how do you find it meaningful to the business you can convert the same way so i'm going to make it continuous from discrete Convert to discrete, sorry, it was continuous. Convert to discrete as well. So now I display line chart. I select only one man dimension for now. Now this makes sense. So first one, net sales going to be a bar chart and net profit going to be a line chart. And this is how it is going to overlap. We can also display members, numbers so that it makes sense. Net sales, display label and net profit also display label. Net sales and net profit label. This is my net sales, I display label over here. And this is my net profit. I display level over here for net profit. So this is how you can see month over month. You can in turn consolidate to quarter over quarter because right now my hierarchy is month. The time dimension, the raw data which I have does not build on according to my time dimension hierarchy. We don't have year, quarter, month is a flat on structure. So in next example, I'll show you how to further massage this data and display this quarterly view of your income statement. So that's it for today. Uh, we'll see the second part of our dashboard in our next video. Thanks for watching today's video. Please subscribe to our channel, our YouTube channel. Our site is bispsolutions.com.